All right, drove all the way back. Here we are. Walk on through security. Then come meet me when I fast travel down. All right, here we go. Better be containing something good, man. And oh crap. <laughs> Concordia, here we go. There you go. <laughs> Alright, let's confront this guy. Thanks for all the likes and support and following me on Twitch. Sexy to Serena, the custom bot's favorite squeeze. Nah, that wouldn't work. Perhaps we could blackmail the Marif with that smutty recording we have of him with that geisha bot. Yahtzee, let's go find ourselves one soon to be outraged customs claptrap. Get that recording ready, Mox. Come back here. I am the law. The law. All right. Where are you? Oh, here you are. Found you. Your awesome Marif's been breaking the law. We have evidence. Breaking the law? Why don't you tell me all about it? Thank you for your concern, citizen. Rest assured it shall be logged. Long live the Marif. Mox, hit it. Oh, blimey. You really know how to listen to a bloke's problems. I'll give you that. You sure I can't book you for more, uh, uh physical services? I'm a bloody stress volcano right now, and I can do with the, uh, with the, uh, Relief. You know that's not what Geisha bots are programmed for. Serena, really? I'm your merit. You'd be doing Concordia Republic service. I'd make it worth your while. I'm swimming in dial money right now. <laughs> the merit's interfacing with my Serena? No! I feel so betrayed! And according to my records, the Marif doesn't have the appropriate paperwork to engage in such activities, which kind of makes my outrage morally justifiable! Awesome! Hey, I'm with you, pal. Word is, he's got another appointment, but we're sure right now. What? Citizens, that was not. That may have sounded like my voice, but I, 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 I've been impersonated by someone who sounds like me. I, I, I appreciate you allowing me privacy at this difficult time. Thank you, thank you. This guy's corrupting my veracity regulators. This guy's so busted. Without an interorganic fraternization license, I'm gonna make his life a living hell. Come on, elevator, let's go. Serena, I'm coming, my love. This is more like it. Finally. I, 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 I've been impersonated. And Wait, why are we going down? Machine, the offices are off. Right, I'm such a kidder. Up we go. I'm gonna kill this machine. <laughs> what? You're not even sweating. Why'd you do that? Robots can't sweat, can they? Can they feel love? All right, let's go. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Stone. Okay. It's a good thing I didn't rush forward or miss a lot of these stuff. What's this? No, oh, crap gun. Oh, another moonstone. Sweet. Alright, awesome, Jack. Officer, get that door open. I don't take orders from civilians. However, as I was already going to do that. What can talk this out, Jackie? I don't really work for Zarbon. Hunter T. Meredith, you are hereby under arrest for violating Elpha's ethical code 3110, forbidding unlicensed interplay between. Oh my god! You stole my girlfriend, you mean that? Open this door! Oh, oh god. Should have said you were dead. Did it dead time. I traced the signal that took down our systems on Helios. And guess what? It came from here. Your office. Signal? Signal. She might be doing. Where did she come from? And please, lie to me. I really want you to lie to me. I don't know. What are you going to do with this? <laughs> Nothing. I was just messing with you. Get the hell out of here. I've been thinking there's a way back to Helios. I surrender. I was gonna let you live, dumb bastard. What is wrong with you? Oh, that was... Yeah, where was I? All right, my awesome master plan. Taking the fight to Helios is gonna need an army, so we make one. Head down to Springs, I'll explain on the way. I'm gonna stay here, gonna go through that Marif stuff. We're making a freaking robot army, baby, hell yeah. Shopping list simple, some serious combat chassis, some top of the line military AI to run them. Word is, Springs is a lady for the AI. Hey Mox, you know where I can build me some kick-ass robot bodies? Since that giant laser is going to kill, well, everyone, I know who might be willing to scout around for hardware. Let me talk to them and get back to you. Sounds good. Let's hustle, people. We got a moon to save. What did you think of Jack when you first met him, Bill? Considering he was the guy Moxie left you for, I didn't like him. You don't like anybody. I like Brick. Booyah! Booyah! Anyways... <laughs> You can see Jack slowly turning. He's like, oh, that was invigorating. I see what you're up to, you handsome Jack. Oh crap, did I go back to the office? Shoot. My bad. It's like looking around, it's like, why can't I leave? So I just thought that was the way back, but I guess it not. So we're gonna get another loading screen. Wasting your life and mine. Our lives are being wasted. Save, save. Alright, come on. Stop saving it. Oh, in that case. Quality. 
opportunity. Goodbye, friend. If you shop anyone. Okay, I think we're supposed to press. It. Yep, there we go. That's what I was doing wrong. Just let me guess, is this 40 right here? No, we need a skeleton lock key. Hmm. For some reason, yet to become clear, that laser persists in firing at the surface of Elpis. How thrilling! I hate dragons. Moxie said you're after some military AI. Big saws. But your best bet's a mate of mine, a little ankle biter by the name of Pickle. Lives in the Outlands. He's almost impossible to reach mine, but I can help with that. Take this scrambler. I shot the mirror. <laughs> now then, I'll upload coordinates of an old Dahl garage to your Echo. Get going, I'll explain on the way. G'day! My grinder, Bessie, finally died and I need to scrounge up a couple of spare parts. Grinder parts don't grow on trees, but luckily I've got wind of two scab grinders you can uh, investigate. Don't worry, they're both stolen, so it's not like you'll be robbing honest folk. The first one's on the back of a buggy. I'm sending the coordinates to your Echo. Let's go shopping. Grinders are brill machines, based on some duck. I have a big problem. Okay. Level twelve. Refrigerator sheet break. Bargains, tissue samples, dinner, all get borrowed soon. I need special eyes. Hmm. Looks like I'm gonna have to do some side missions. Level eleven. Okay, you know what? We can ignore that. Level nine. I just have no choice. Can't pick this. Keep things cool a long time. You fetch specialized from special place. I pay you. Yes. A mission of mercy sounds like a job I was made for. Yes, it's good. You take drill now. Nope, gotta go back for the drill. Oh, take yes. Now I'm coming. Get drill. Okay, woman. Get specialized. Okay. Level twelve, my goodness. What am I doing? All little creatures? Okay. Oh god. It's so easy to press that. It's ridiculous. What level? 11? The time is coming when this land will be blasted clean of warlords and petty kings and queens. People's Liberation Army are. Sorry. Uh, well, of course, I have to listen to this. This place on foot, but I can help you out with. Ready for it? A stingray. It's old Dal Tick. 
They're not much to look at, but Moxie tinkered with the design, so now they jump like a skag in heat. Problem is, stingrays aren't easy to get your meat hunts on. So it happens that Scrambler, uh, came my way. It's supposed to unlock digestructing at the old Dahl garage I'm sending you to. Once you unlock a stingray there, I'll fix it so all moon zoomies are stingrayed up. Ooh, stingray, huh? No, can't do level 11 right now. I'm gonna pick up a lot of side quests for now. So I can level up. <laughs> Want a mission? Who are you? It's a kid. A lot of time or constraints you have to try again? Oh god. Try and break my record, eh? Good luck. I meant that sarcastically. You should look that word up. Nobody can handle pop racing better than the Lone Stalker. <gasps> or, to look at it another way, you suck and I'm better. <gasps> Whatever. I'm the best and all. Get yourself a moon buggy and prove me wrong. Okay. There's a moon buggy. Okay, wrong seat. Oh, you found that snot nosed brat, did you? I'd love to see you wipe the floor with him. So, would everyone else who's ever met him, head over to the start line. Let's see what you can do. The countdown will begin once you're at the start line. Kick it in the gut soon as the beacons light up. Beat the kid's lap time and rub the grub's face in it. Uh, lame. You can't catch the loon stalker. Check that. If you also beat him on the first go at it, I'll give you even more credits. Show the little darling who's boss. Ooh. Oh, I suck at driving in this game. Initiating countdown. Five. Four, three, two, and then one go. And they're off. Alright, here we go. Sorry, there was a sharp turn right there, I didn't want to miss it. I can hear my amazing skill pumping through my What the frick, oh, dude? No. What happens if I'm so skilled I explode? Okay, then we wanna lap around here. Working on it. My car is almost dead though. I think I'm doing okay on time, we'll see. Okay, another sharp turn. Oh, I'm sitting on the edge of my bucket seat. Okay, here we go. Gotta boost it right here. Oh shoot, please make it. 21 seconds. Come on, mother. 13. This is the last one. Uh, Did it. Cheated, and I wasn't feeling well. And then I got something in my eye. And I couldn't see properly. And someone distracted me and it's not fair. Ha! Suck eggs, napkins. You just got beat. Vault Hunter, you can collect your winnings from the darling little angel himself. Give it to me, kid. Dad! Some dumb military left out unit just totally cheated me! Out of the gods' record! Wow, you really are slow. Hmm. Here we go. Fault 
Punish the stinky bull hunter for cheating! I'm gonna rip out your guts and let little nappykins decorate his room with them! Uh, okay. Guy's threatening me, now what? <laughs> Okay, has to be up there. Avenger with the laser weapons. Okay. Okay, let's kill Scavenger with laser weapons then. Come in here. You among us, equipping us for the coming Me. battle, our soldiers will take heart. I don't see any around. The frick's blocking me. Here they are. I'm going to fucking die. Things up a bit, 
really send a message. Set fire to a few scabs. Help clean the place up a bit. Don't forget, you'll need to do it in an oxygen-rich environment. Go science! Give me your best shot! Six more. Okay, I think got them all.
really use my chain. And that weapon works a treat on them, bar the not burning part. I've been dying to tinker with a laser weapon for ages. Bring it back to mine and let's see what they can do. You might learn a thing or two as well. <coughs> It's not much to comment anymore, I'm just, you know, just leveling and doing stuff. In. She's over here. Nice work dealing with those scabs. Fire weapons love a bit of flesh to work on, especially in an atmosphere. Give me that weapon and let's have a bit. I've been tinkering with that laser you gave me. Made a few frosty adjustments. I'd love to see what it does to talks now. Another of Elvis's deadly denizens. Okay, gotta try 